Welcome to our lecture online. Here we're starting a new section with uh, example problems dealing with linear dimensions because we only want to deal with linear equations. The problem reads as follows. Cut a 21-foot pipe into two pieces. Make the shorter piece half the length of the longer piece. How long is each piece? Sometimes it helps to get a visualization of what the problem is. So let's say we're, we represent a piece of pipe that's 21 feet long, <clears throat> like this. So the length here is 21 feet. And we're going to cut the, piece into, the pipe into two pieces. So that means we're going to take the pipe and cut it into one piece over here and another piece over here. And then they tell us that the shorter piece is half the length of the longer piece. So that means the length of this little piece is only half as much as the length of the big piece. Now, how do we solve that problem? Well, we're going to let x equal d. Well, let's see here. Since we have the shorter piece expressed in terms of the longer piece, you could let x equal the longer piece. Now, this is contrary to what we normally do. Normally, we let x be the smaller of the things that are there. But let's try it this way, because the sentence says that we make the shorter piece half the length of the longer piece. So it makes sense in this case that the longer piece is considered x, and then we write the shorter piece in terms of x. So that means the length of the longer piece is equal to x. So how to express the shorter piece? Well, the shorter piece is half the length of the longer piece. So let x divided by 2, which is half, equal to the shorter piece. And so this piece here would have a length of x over 2, which clearly shows that this is half the length of this piece. x over 2 is half of x. And that's why we let x be the longer piece, and x over 2 be the shorter piece, being half the longer piece. Now we know that the sum of the two pieces need to add up to 21 feet, which means that x plus x over 2 equals 21, and now we need to solve that equation for x. First, what we want to do is get rid of the fraction, so we're going to multiply both sides by 2. That gives us 2x plus x is equal to, uh, let's see here, 42. 3x is equal to 42, divide both sides by 3, 3 goes on 42, 14 times, so x equals 14. That means the longer piece needs to be 14 feet. x is 14 feet. And the shorter piece is half of that. That means it is 7 feet. And then you can clearly see that 7 feet plus 14 feet does indeed add up to 21 feet. So the answer then would be the longer piece is equal to 14 feet. And the shorter piece is equal to 7 feet. And that's how it's done.